I hope you're hungry because we've got five crazy, cool, epic, awesome, funny, weird, wild, and expected true <sighs> facts about burgers. Number five. The term hamburger comes from Hamburg steaks that were introduced in the U.S. by immigrants from the German city of Hamburg. The origin of the burger is controversial, but the most well-known story includes an Athens, Texas cook named Fletcher Davis in the late 1800s. Old Dave, as he was nicknamed, claimed he had the idea of putting ground beef between two pieces of Texas toast when one of his customers was in too much of a hurry to sit down for a meal. The customer was so satisfied with this newfangled sandwich that Old Dave decided to make it a staple menu item. Fletcher also had a hamburger stall at the 1904 St. Louis World's Fair, which helped introduce a mass audience to these delectable patties. Step right up, step right up, we got hamburgers here, you'll be tasting the future. You'll be eating your hamburger and your flying coal one day. Number four. After Fletcher's success, for the next decade or so, the hamburger steadily gained popularity all around the United States. It became so popular, in fact, that when the U.S. entered World War I in 1917, the government and soldiers started referring to hamburgers as Liberty Sandwiches to avoid its connection to their new German enemy. Oh, and they also changed the name of sauerkraut to Liberty Cabbage, just to be safe. Hmm, German chocolate cake? Oh, how about, uh... Ah, freedom chocolate cake. Bratwurst? Hmm. Bald eagle sausage. Frankfurter hot dog? Oh wait, that's, that's what we call it. Number three. Big burger chains will do whatever it takes to make hamburgers look extra appealing in commercials. Professionals will painstakingly select the perfect slices of onion, pickle, and lettuce, then apply them to the burger patty with surgical precision. They hand melt the cheese on top with lighters or blowtorches to get that perfect piece of melted cheese and apply condiments like ketchup and mustard with syringes. Sometimes, the burger patties are even painted to look extra charbroiled, and the finished product is misted with water to give it that special glisten. Because of these tactical tricks, burgers you order from fast food places tend to look nothing like the advertisement. Huh, who knew making fast food commercials was a fine art? Number two, the Hamburger Hall of Fame. And yes, that's a real thing. Located in Seymour, Wisconsin, this elaborate structure celebrates the mouth-watering history of the burger. Ooh, let's see more. They also put on an annual one-day burger festival, which in 1989 featured the world's largest hamburger at 5,520 pounds that was served to festival guests. Burger Fest also includes a 5K bun run, the world's longest hamburger parade, a hamburger eating contest, and a ketchup slide. Gross, but awesome, but gross. And finally, our number one fact about burgers, the most bizarre burgers ever sold. That's right, fast food burger joints around the world aren't just satisfied with selling burgers with cheese, lettuce, and tomato. Over the years, they've tried some seriously strange sandwiches. Burger King's BK Whopper Bar in New York City sells a New York pizza burger, a nine inch wide burger made with four Whopper patties and topped with pepperoni, mozzarella, marinara, and pesto sauce. McDonald's founder Ray Kroc also invented the Hula Burger, which was just grilled pineapple and cheese on a bun. But it's not just the United States that has all the fun with their burgers. McDonald's in Mexico serves the Flaming Hot Doritos Quarter Pounder which is a normal quarter pounder topped with Doritos and guacamole. McDonald's in Japan sells the Gracoro Burger, a breadcrumb crusted patty made out of macaroni, shrimp, and a creamy white sauce. Burger King in Japan also sells a premium berry burger, which has a sticky fruit sauce on top. They also make the pumpkin bomb when the season's right. It comes stuffed with bacon, a nut sauce, and 10 slices of fried pumpkin. That's not weird enough for you? Okay, well then maybe their Black Whopper is for you. This guy comes with black cheese, which is dyed with bamboo charcoal, a black bun, and a squid ink onion garlic sauce. And finally, to celebrate the launch of Windows 7 in Japan, yes, that Windows 7, Microsoft teamed with Burger King to make a Whopper with seven beef patties. What? My favorite is KFC's burger sold in Korea, the Zinger Double Down. It's a beef patty topped with bacon, barbecue, and white pepper sauces, 
and is sandwiched between two pieces of fried chicken instead of a bun. You know, that all sounds great, but personally, I'll stick to veggie burgers. What? I'm a vegetarian. And there they are, five delicious facts about burgers. What's your absolute favorite burger, if you could only eat one for the rest of your life? Personally, I'd pick Ma's Homemade with Love Burger. Let us know by commenting below and make sure to check out five facts about cheese if you want to turn that hamburger into a cheeseburger. And then remember to subscribe to DreamWorks TV for new episodes of Five Facts every Tuesday. I'm your host, and I'm super hungry, so I'm going to go make my own burger now with all the fixings. Ooh, let's see. The hot sauce, some jalapenos. Ooh, maybe a little habanero. Oh, I like spicy things, you know. Ooh, put some wasabi on there. Little ghost pepper. Some chipotle just for the fixings. All right, let's take a bite. Mm. <laughs>